What's going on guys? It's Shane. We are back here again with another video. Today we're going to be returning to Cherokee Independent School District. Uh, we're going to be checking out Fayette Independent Schools. This is the Kentucky Spec game I was referring to in the last video. I thought that's what we were checking out, but it was the BD edition apparently. Um, we were on the Community Edition the other day, so um, here we are. Uh, I don't think I've ever checked this game out. Um, I might have, but it might have received like a huge update um, because I don't recall any of this. This is a huge building over there. It looks like a mall almost. Um, can you go over here? I don't know if you can go in here or not. You can't. Okay. It's very cool though. Here's their lot. Very, very big. Uh, the structure is very nice. Uh, they're kind of... The parking lots are kind of on a slope. Um, I did try spawning in a bus and it completely went down the slope before I even started it. So um, that's probably a little bit of an issue. Um, but the, like I said, the whole structure, the way it's set up is very, very nice. Um, nice slow snow globe here. Um, so let's spawn in a bus. Here's their spawner. Uh, it's hurting my eyes a little bit, but <laughs> it's very bright. Um, some of their buses, they got CEs, HGX, um, C2s. Let me check out this C2 real quick. Some of these are, yeah, some of these are s assigned to different people. Uh, oh, I didn't see the BBB. -B 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 -B. Let's see that. Oh, we might drive that. Let's see. Uh... I don't know. It looks weird. <laughs> it looks weird. Um, main battery. So this is probably a 22 or 23. One or the other. Probably. Um, what does it say? Okay. Yeah, it's probably a 22. Yeah. I don't think we're going to drive. Well. Trying to think of what the viewers might want to see. I don't think they want to see a Bluebird Vision. Um, let's try a C2, that one that's available, hopefully. Let's see. Not that one. Um, the HDX isn't too bad, but I don't think we can get a C2. There's not very many. Yeah. There's a 2020, but we're looking for something new. Let's just go with an HDX. Why not? Not that one, though. That one will work. <clears throat> so I was informed that this game is more up-to-date than their community game. I don't know why people do that. The community game is going to get more recognition from new people, new players. Um, there's a few companies that do that. They don't update their main games, which is... Beyond me. I mean, I get it. This is where your activity is going to come from. But to get new people in your company, the first game they're going to check out is your community edition. And that's going to set the tone. Depending on whether or not they want to get trained and stuff to join the BD game, you know. But it is what it is. Okay. So it's kind of your stock Gen X, just like in the other game. But the bus looks amazing, though, from the outside. Um, I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Kentucky Spec is definitely one of the better. I mean, that black stripe just looks so iconic, and it's it looks it makes the bus look so good. It really does. I don't know if any other states use that, or any other districts use like the little black stripe. Um, but I know Kentucky uses it for sure. And this is a Kentucky spec game. I don't know what it's based out of. I guess Fayette, but I don't know where that is. Probably Northern Kentucky. I don't know. <clears throat> Love the usage of the bike lanes. I think they used the bike lanes in the other game as well that we checked out. Um, no other companies really utilize bike lanes. So this map is really, really big and it's kind of like a city, like a whole city. So bike lanes would make a lot of sense. 
because you know you have NBC with upstate, upstate New York. You're probably not gonna have bike lanes in upstate New York. Are you have them in New York? Probably not upstate. Maybe in some areas, but I'm actually not familiarized with upstate New York. You'd think I would be, but I'm not. So they got a middle school, high school, preschool, elementary, campus, bowling alley, Memorial Park. I remember that from there. I think I remember that Memorial Park pulling into it that one time. Um, I think I recall something like that. <clears throat> they got a farm, science academy. We're not going to be able to check out everything. Obviously, this map looks pretty huge. But... I've never really been involved with this company, uh, dating back to, uh, what was it, MVT. Uh, even then I wasn't really involved. I kind of was for a little bit, but then they kind of shut down and stuff like that. So I think Cosmic is still the owner, I do believe. I don't know if he's working on these maps by himself, I highly doubt it. Uh, not to say that he couldn't, I'm sure he could, he just... I think he does have some developers. I think, um, what's his name? Uh, why can't I open the doors? Oh, it's F, that's right. Have I not been opening the doors? I think I have, though. Let me check. V. V. Oh, I haven't been opening the doors. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that. I don't know why they do that. I guess they just make it feel more realistic when you're pressing different keys to do different stuff. Which, I mean, makes sense. Because in real life it technically would be two different buttons, wouldn't it? Or isn't there like a master key or something? Switch or something like that that does them all? I don't know. And should wipers work? Somewhat. Got some snowfall. Oh, what is this? Looks like a different type of housing unit. Definitely is. Looks like a mesh. Is it? That's a nice mesh. If it is, I think it is. It's a nice build right there. see I don't know if this thing is at the top of my screen you got the time over here on the left uh, this huge um, menu for your bus spawning and despawning it would be nice if that would kind of get out of the way you could honestly make like a simple um, what's it called where it you know you hover over it and it'll pop up on the screen kind of like NBC has it's not too hard to do I know this because I've seen it. Why isn't the... There it goes. Weird. <clears throat> oh, I needed a screenshot. Actually, I think I have one. I tried to do a video on this game already. I had to stop it midway because I... I have... I'm a perfectionist and if I... I said this before, but if my if I say like one wrong thing or if I slip up, oh, am I gonna make this? Oh, that's so weird. Um, I'll just end up I'll end up scrapping the whole recording and starting over. What is that building? That's the high school. That's a nice build. Almost looks like a hospital, but it's pretty nice. I wonder who built that. Is 
huge parking lot. Can we go through here? I think we can. We're just going to drop off here and then we're going to check out some other areas and then kind of wrap up the video there. I think I'm going the right way. I hope I am. This is a bit sketch right here, but you could make that look a lot better if you use smaller proportions. That's the handicap lane. This is nice. We probably shouldn't be parking on this in the middle one, but I thought that whole lane right there was the handicap, but no. A lot of server messages. What does that say? Lafayette Parish Schools. Is that what Fayette's short for? I would assume so. I don't know what's with the uh, font used on the uh, district name here. They kind of did like a bold for the name and then use like a regular for the county schools. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that or not. The uh, Allison shifter electric doesn't work on the inside. You know, they didn't used to work up for the buses at NBC. I had to spend like an hour trying to find the correct uh, s script to where that was located. I finally found it and I fixed it. So now they all work. So if Cosmic watches this video and you need help with that, I can definitely show you. Because that was actually a pain to find. And I think the reason they're not using it is probably, that's probably why. They probably just don't. They probably don't mind it, honestly. Although their turn signals are a bit different. They use, they, it looks like they put their custom ones in, I don't know. Uh, this is weird. This isn't right at all. Oh, this is for like turning left, I guess. I meant to go right, so no, we're going to go left. I wasn't paying attention. This is kind of the way we came from. Why is my door still open? Oh my god. I think I just opened it on accident. See what the lights look like on the inside? Oh, is there a different keybind for the cockpit lights? I wish I knew it. Okay, no. Because it only turns those on back there, but it doesn't turn these two on. Hmm. Oops. I hit my mic. These lights are ridiculous. 
کرد So what do we got here? We got a lake or something? A river? Not frozen. Oh, weird. <laughs> you could drive right off this thing. with There's no boundary or... What's the term? Border? I don't know. There's a track field down there. Two of them. I don't know where I'm going at this point. That, that road there is closed off, apparently. I think that was supposed to be closed off. Because it doesn't look like it's done. I don't know. Maybe not. When do we go? So the window opens. This is gonna take forever. Dude, these lights are insane. Lord. I think that is a mall over there. This light does not turn in five seconds. We're going one, two, three, four, five. We're going. <laughs> They're probably that long for like, because this is where they host all their routes and stuff. I've never actually been to any other routes. I should probably go see what it's like. Uh, so I'm sure they make things a bit longer, so the, you know, it kind of feels, um, real life, you know what I mean? So the elementary school is off there in the back. Does that lead to a dead end down there? I don't know. Probably. So yeah, it looks like some townhouses right there, or some duplexes. Looks like another shopping center over here. So it looks like this part of the map is very open. They got some unfinished stuff down there. Oh, I wait. I just had a video idea that just came to me. I'm actually going to check it out right after I end this. Oh, gosh. Uh, quick tip. You want to turn off collision on all your signs because for one things like that happen and two it'll uh, reduce a little bit of lag for sure because that's something that definitely doesn't need to be uh, collidable that and trees I would definitely turn collisions off on all those for sure Even these up here. I'm sure collision's on on those. So, let's see. Yeah, that's definitely a mall. I'm pretty sure I see different stores there. We're running it. But this is very nice right here with the uh, trees here in the middle. The lot looks very nice, as I mentioned before. This whole area looks nice with all the trees and the bike lanes. It's probably my favorite area in the map. Granted, I haven't explored everything, but there's a nice clock tower there and everything. But we'll head back to the lot. If the light ever turns, here we go. No? Not yet. No, because they get to go. Of course. Of course.
You know what? We've broken one law. Let's break another. Because, yes. Oh, no, now you want to turn. Oh, boy. Did you know in some states, in some little towns, um, this is what I heard. I don't know if it's true, but it's on TikTok. Um, if, if you're out at, like, beyond, I think they said, 1 a.m. or 1 in the morning, and there's no cars around, and the light won't turn, you can actually run it. Don't do that, because I don't know if it's true, but in some little towns, you know, like, off the beaten path, you know, that are more lenient to stuff like that, I think you're allowed to do that. Obviously, it depends on the county and, you know, other rules and stuff, but, um, like, if there's no traffic around, only is it... Uh, allowed, you know. So I thought that was pretty interesting. Because I think there's people that do that all the time. You know, if you're out at like 1 a.m. And obviously you can tell if the traffic light has like a camera on it or something. Because uh, if it's like an older one, it won't. Uh, you, I'm telling you, like, uh, maybe 5 out of 10 people are running that red. They're going to treat it as a stop sign, which I think in a lot of cases, that is allowed some places. Obviously, if it's a blinking red, then that's, you know, that's a stop sign. You want to yield and make sure nobody's coming, but. We're just going to park anywhere. I know this wasn't where that bus was parked, but. Or maybe, no, I think it was up there. Yeah. I'm going to turn this thing off. Hopefully it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Child check. Child check off. Why is the back? Oh, the back window looks frozen. Look at that. Looks like a, it's a plastic texture, but it looks like there's ice on it. Come on. I'm stuck. Get me out of here. Okay. We're just going to do that. Okay. Well, this was their BD version. Uh, actually, I shouldn't even say version because this is a whole new game. This is Fayette Independent Schools. Uh, their BD game. Um, if you guys do wish to check it out yourself, you will be... I think you need to be ranked... I don't know. You need to be ranked bus driver and up, I guess. Um, so to check it out, you will be, you know... You'll have to attend a training, I assume, and stuff like that. But it will be linked in the description down below if you do wish to play it yourself. Um, let me know if you want me to return to this game. I'd like to, honestly. Check for sleeping children. Yes, yes, you should. But, um, yeah, if you, guys like the, 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 if you guys like the video, please leave a like and subscribe. And I will catch you guys next time. Peace.